During the Battle of Gettysburg, countless civilians displayed immense courage. One woman, Jenny Wade, became a hero. Mary Virginia Wade, known as Jenny Wade, was born on Baltimore Street and lived on Breckenridge Street. Both structures still stand. As the intensity of battle grew, Jenny left home to be with family at her sister's house. This image shows Jenny on the right, her mother in the middle, and her sister on the left. Unfortunately, her sister's home was caught in the crossfire of opposing forces. Southern sharpshooters utilized buildings in town and exchanged fire with Union troops as evidenced by these bullet holes. On the morning of July 3, 1863, it is believed a Confederate sharpshooter fired a shot towards the Union position on Cemetery Hill. The bullet passed through this door and pierced Jenny Wade, killing her instantly. She was only 20 years old. Nearby Union soldiers arrived at the scene and helped escort the surviving family members to the cellar. Jenny Wade was kneading dough to make bread for soldiers when the fateful bullet struck. She would go down as the only civilian killed during the Battle of Gettysburg. You can visit Jenny's final resting place inside the Evergreen Cemetery. An American flag flies over her grave 24-7 as a tribute to her lasting legacy in Gettysburg and beyond.